Okay, so if you didn't already know, I am um, kind of obsessed with the DJI Osmo Action 3, specifically the way that it handles USB-C audio. And uh, it's kind of turned into an unhealthy obsession where I have been, my eyes have been open to the world of USB-C microphones, and I've been like trying as many as I can with the Action 3 in an, in an attempt to find I don't know, the best sounding mic for content creation. So today we're gonna to do an unboxing and um, I don't really like doing unboxings, but I thought it would be fun for you and I to listen to a brand new microphone connected to the Action 3 together. And uh, today we're looking at the Samson Go mic. Big shout out to Dracomis because he was the one who made a video on this, um, telling everyone that it was on sale for $20 on Amazon. I, uh, I've had my eye on this little guy for, I don't know, a couple months now, but I think it was at a price point of like somewhere between 50 to $80. Yeah, when I saw it was 20 bucks, I had to pull the trigger. So let's, let's like unbox this guy. So there are a couple things that um, I did to prep this. And that was, I have a couple accessories that I'm gonna use with this, with this microphone, specifically this guy, this Tozo, monitor mount. It is a cold shoe to quarter inch adapter that has like an angle bracket. I think it's meant for monitors to mount on top of a, a camera. Uh, I also have a couple different lengths of um, USB-C to mini USB because I think this is the connection that this microphone actually uses. And I have, um, I think it comes with a mini USB-C to USB-A and uh, when I was doing all my exploration into USB-C microphones, I got some of these adapters. So let's crack this open. Oh, this is this is significantly smaller than I thought it was going to be. So that's kind of fun. Um, let's see. So I think this is actually designed to go on top of like a laptop screen with this clip. And then you can kind of position your microphone in a way that best suits you. Uh, the side does have a cardioid pickup pattern, minus 10, and an omnidirectional pickup pattern. So I don't know, do we need to look at the accessories or anything else in here? Comes with the cool bag, comes with that mini USB to USB-A cable, and uh, yeah, a bunch of documentation. Okay. Okay, so how am I gonna mount this onto here? I think I am going to use this quarter 20 threaded base. So I think I can do this. Uh, this hole in the bottom is actually, yeah, 3 8 inch base. So I'll thread that in here. Okay, look at this. Got a little microphone now. Ah, uh, okay, here goes nothing. Okay, sweet. We have uh, we have the mic icon and the Samson mic light is illuminated. Yeah, this is kind of neat. Okay, yeah, I think uh, I think that guy looks. Looks pretty decent. So the big question now is how does this <laughs> cherry rig setup actually sound? Okay, now we are recording with the Samson Go mic attached to my DJI Osmo Action 3 via a mini USB to USB-C cable. Uh, like I said, the Samson, I changed it to the cardioid pickup pattern because the minus 10 seemed like it was a little too much of a pad for speaking at arm's length or pseudo arm's length. And the Action 3 is set to a gain of minus three dB. And so I haven't listened to this. In fact, you are probably hearing it before I am hearing it right at this very moment. So I'm going to, um, yeah. I'm gonna take a listen and then I'll come back and I'll give you, I'll give you my thoughts on whether the Samson Go mic is a good fit for the DJI Osmo Action 3. Okay, so I just listened back to the footage and to quote one of my favorite viral videos. We're seeing some shit we ain't never seen before, kid. 
Yeah, I can't I can't believe how good this $20 microphone sounds plugged into an action camera. So I did um a little bit of tweaking to how I have the whole thing set up just so that I could come up with like the most optimal streamlined way and least unobtrusive way and uh yeah, I've come up with with this. So basically, I have the Samson Go mic. I took off the clip at the top. It's going into that Toezo monitor adapter. And I have a different cable that uh, uses a USB-A to USB-C adapter. And yeah, this, uh, this sounds like surprisingly good. You know, is this a ridiculous microphone camera combination? Yeah, probably. But what it really exemplifies is the potential that USB-C audio has for in-camera audio inputs. I mean, just imagine one of the big problems that we always complain about as content creators who like audio is that most camera preamps, those 3.5 millimeter mic inputs, and the digital conversion that the cameras do uh, produce really noisy audio. But if in the future, camera manufacturers decide to go with this USB-C uh, digital audio input route, that puts the onus on all of the heavy lifting for the audio work on the microphone. So in the case of this Samson Go, which is currently like 20 bucks, that takes the analog signal it captures, converts it into a digital audio signal, sends it via USB-C directly into the camera, and the audio sounds crystal clear. I mean, come on, have you ever heard audio from an action camera sound this good from a $20 microphone? So yeah, I think that USB-C audio is no joke. If you have an Action 3 and you're looking for uh, a little USB mic that sounds excellent and won't break the and won't break the bank definitely check out the samson go mic uh, again props to dracomis for letting me know that this was on sale for twenty dollars this has been probably one of my best buys that i have made in the last i don't know year and a half or so <laughs> so yeah this little guy he's awesome thanks for watching and we'll talk again real soon